for everyone who was waiting to apply to the ISB YLP or the ISB early entry option, you have the answer to your questions now. So you can apply to the ISB PGP YL. So, the, so this is a new program which has been announced by ISB recently. And here are some things that you need to know about the ISB PGP YL. First of all, the duration. The duration of the program is 20 months and this program will be offered at the Hyderabad campus. Next comes the eligibility. If you want to apply to the ISB PGP YL, you need to have uh, anywhere between 0 to 24 months of work experience. The 24 months of work experience will be calculated up till 15th June 2025 for the current intake which is coming up. What is the deadline for the ISB PGP YL? The deadline for this year's intake is 21st December 2024. The applications have not yet opened up. They, will, they are expected to open up very soon. But what will be there in the application process, we can go into it slightly as of now. One, you will need the test scores. Which are the test scores which are acceptable for the ISB PGP YL applicants? First, you can submit your GMAT score or you can submit your GRE score and you can also submit your CAT score. So these are the three test scores will, which will be acceptable for the ISB PGP YL admissions process. So yes, ISB now accepts the CAT score as well for the ISB PGP YL admission cycle. The GMAT or the GRE test takers need to know that only the test center based scores will be accepted for this admission process as well. This is very similar to how the ISB PGP process is going on currently. Earlier when you used to apply to the ISB YLP or the ISB early entry option, these were deferred admission options. So you used to, you know, once you had completed that mandatory years of work experience, the mandatory period of work experience, you joined the ISP PGP class. But this is a new program. The intake is going to be a separate intake of 120 professionals and the program starts in July every year. So this is uh, what you should know about the ISP PGP while a lot of details about the curriculum, etc. are already available and you can go through that and research as to whether this is the right program for you. The alternative uh, program that you can go in for once you have more than 24 months of work experience would be the ISB PGP program. What are the differences between the ISB PGP and the ISB PGP YL? As of now, there are some clear differences. The first is the duration of the ISB PGP YL is 20 months, while the duration of the ISB PGP is one year. The eligibility for the ISB PGP YL is up to 24 months of experience, so that is 0 to 24 months of work experience. The eligibility for ISB PGP is more than 24 months of work experience. The test scores which are going to be acceptable for ISB PGP YL are GMAT, GRE or the CAT score. However, the application process for ISB PGP accepts the GMAT or the GRE score. The similarity is that both the, test, both the programs will accept only the test center scores. So all the best in case you need any assistance with your essays or your interview prep, get in touch with us. For people who don't have their GMAT or the GRE test scores, but they want to apply to the PGP YL since the deadline is 21st December, I seriously recommend that you should, you know, get done with your GMAT or GRE as soon as possible. Or let's say, you know, till the mid to end of November so that you have a clear timeline of where you stand on the test scores. Is it competitive enough? Do you need to rewrite it again? You will have the bandwidth to take that decision if you do it towards the mid of November and also parallelly work on your essays, your application, as well as then the interview prep. So all the best in case you need any help, feel free to get in touch with us.